My guest today is Corey, the general manager at yeah, yeah, yeah. Flix Brew House in Mansfield, Texas. Uh, this is a really fun new concept that re opened recently. Uh, tell us about it. Flix Brew House. Uh, we have 10 locations, uh, but we are the first ones in Mansfield and we opened on September 28th. Mm -hmm. It started on 2011 in Round Rock, Texas. Mm -hmm. uh, what makes us unique is First off, I want to talk about our people. Yeah. Uh, when you walk into a Flix, you know you're inside a Flix. Just coming to greet you, get the smiling face you see, mm -hmm. will make you feel like you're coming into your own home, uh, greeting family. Because that's what we are. We're family once you walk inside the building. Uh, you, we are scratch kids. Mm -hmm. So everything that you order is made right then and there. Uh, the seats are the best seats you're going to find mm -hmm. uh, because it fits you and your body style. Uh, the seats are adjustable. The table is amazing. It fits you. Uh, just right. Yeah, amazing beer that we'll try later in the show. Uh, talk about the movies because I noticed you guys bring back some cult classics. It's not just your typical theater where you only have the new releases. Correct. You do have both, but correct. Talk about so, the uh, something that sets us apart. For example, we have Five Nights at Freddy's that's opening this weekend. We, we have it. Mm -hmm. uh, but also, uh, last week we did Psycho, uh, Shun of the Dead. Mm -hmm. The show Shun of the Dead is uh, like a cult classic. Mm -hmm. People love it. One of my yeah. favorite horror movies. And not only do we do that movie, we create a whole special meeting just for that movie. Oh. Uh, so when you buy that movie ticket, it comes along. When you, all you do is buy your ticket, the meal is already there for you. Oh, cool. Uh, so it comes with a special yeah. beer, uh, it comes with a special appetizer, mm -hmm. it comes with a special entree, and then we have dessert, and sometimes it's multiple different drinks to match the type of oh, so it's super fun. We uh, have something that we call Troopers. Mm -hmm. So they also dress up our side of the movie theater. Uh, and they be all dressed up in that costume to fit the theme of mm -hmm. the movie. Uh, very fun. We give away uh, th uh, stickers sometimes, give away cups. Uh, for example, next week we have something called Lost Boys. Actually tomorrow, mm -hmm. uh, Lost Boys, where we will give out uh, little raffles and we play games. And we will also give out an award for the winner mm -hmm. as well. Awesome. Uh, please tell your owners to bring one to Fort Worth soon. <laughs> we have a million people in our population waiting for this right, amazing right. concept. Uh, but each month you kind of curate the movies to the uh, time of year. Correct. So what's going to happen throughout the rest of this year? Yes, yeah, so in December we have something called Flixmas. Uh -huh. uh, and we're going to be doing 25 days of Christmas. Uh -huh. uh, and it's gonna be a little different, you know. You got things like Elf, uh, Elf. Mm -hmm. and then we are throwing some uh, some newer movies as well. And then we will still curate uh, a fan fest to some of those special movies where we'll still have our troopers dress up. It won't be like that for every uh, Christmas movie, uh, but we will have that mm -hmm. going on as well for December. Uh, all Christmas movies for 25 days. Uh, also, uh, we're doing a little promotion for gift cards during mm -hmm. the time as well. Uh, so every $25 gift card you get, we'll give you a free ticket. Mm -hmm. So you buy $50, it's two free tickets. Okay. It's really fun. I was joking about coming to Fort Worth, but it's really a short drive. It was, it was 25 minutes to get here. So Fort Worth, come out to, to Mansfield, uh, check out this space. Uh, it's, it's really fun, it's creative, it's unique, and it's comfortable, right? Right, so, yes, sir, <laughs> comfortable. You get real comfortable after that second beer, too. Right, right. right. <laughs> you do, you, you do. Just settle into that, that amazing seat and just enjoy the movie. But yes. I can tell you guys, enjoy your job here. And, you know, it's been really fun getting to know you. So Yeah, so we we, we, we always preach. We uh -huh. want our staff to have fun uh -huh. for, our, for our guests to have fun. Awesome. And uh, social media website, how can folks find y'all? Uh, so you just go to flixbrewhouse.com okay. okay. and then you will click on our yeah. application, which we will manage so okay. and find the track. And then one of you click Fort Worth, hopefully. Right, right. right. Oh, exactly. like finger, fingers crossed. Right. Right. Of course, it's been a pleasure. It's been an absolute pleasure. Thanks for your time. Uh, Matt, before we talk about your beer, you have an amazing brew system that you said is custom? Yes. Tell yeah. us about that. No, so it's custom. Uh, we actually, uh, so we imported our uh, all of our stainless in from overseas. Mm -hmm. uh, so it's all 304L, uh, low carbon stainless. Uh, super blessed to be yeah. working on the system that we work Pretty on. It's, 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 it's an awesome system. So these are our flagship offerings. Uh, we have, we're drinking uh, Luna Rosa. About to drink. Right now. Let's do it. Cheers. Cheers. Get into this guy. Yeah. Mm. It's an American wheat ale. 84 pounds of raspberries go in every batch that we do. Taste that. So, nice, tart, refreshing, crisp. Mm -hmm. um, so yeah, we'll offer these four year round. Mm -hmm. um, we have a lemon, beautiful, bright mm -hmm. tanks upstairs. Um, aside from those four, we'll offer um, we'll offer national seasonals that will all kind of collab. We'll okay. do a, a nice, uh, we'll powwow we'll get together and, and come up with some really awesome stuff. Mm -hmm. um, we actually won a bronze medal for mm -hmm. our Tropical Mirage. That one um, was one of those collaborative efforts. Okay. So, um, yeah, I had a couple of brewers um, kind of throw their hat in the ring there, get some ideas to go, mm -hmm. cooked it up, and uh, got 
about to take home some uh, hardware. Awesome, congrats. So Lucha Libre is our uh, Mexican lager. We won um, a silver medal for mm -hmm. Australia Asian lager at uh, Great American Beer Festival okay. uh, last year. So a uh, nice, crisp, crisp, clean, refreshing beer. Absolutely. Easy drinking, as they say. Keeps the lights on. <laughs> probably very popular in Texas. Definitely. Uh, that's probably my favorite. Uh, that's my go-to after work. Oh, this one here? Oh, yeah. Okay. okay. Or during nice work. Easy. Or during you're, work. You're, you're, yeah, yeah. you're a brewer, so you can say that. Yeah. Okay. yeah, yeah. The one job, you can say that, and I'm a professional. Uh, what is this one? Uh, Ten days. So this is our Scottish ale. Mm. So this one's going to be a little more roasty. A little whole-bodied, roasty. Yeah. yeah get, definitely got a little bit of heart to it. Mm-hmm. Um, and then Nebulous is our hazy IPA. Okay. Oh, that's, again, juicy, very full. Nice full body. Yes, yeah. definitely. That's what we're going for. Uh, this is actually probably my favorite batch that I've gone down so far. So, okay. <laughs> definitely proud of that one. So, when you, when you come up with new beers, do uh, you try to go wacky or conventional? And you know, it, that's a really good question. Um, you know, there's a uh, different search for different folks, obviously. Mm -hmm. <laughs> we definitely like to offer um, a, a nice wider or range, right? Um, the, um, my head brewer uh, that I learned everything uh, that I know, um, German lagers and ales were his specialty. Mm -hmm. So you get to fall in love with that. I'm definitely an IPA guy. I love, I, I can knock out lager beer all day long. Uh, but I mean, from sour to sweet to umami to hoppy, mm -hmm. just everything under the rainbow is kind of something that I'm willing to brew. Awesome. Definitely look forward to uh, serving Mansfield with. Well, I haven't had a chance to see a movie and have a beer yet, but I know this is kind of a novel idea because usually you have macro beers on tap if you, if you even have beers in movie theater. But folks here get kind of spoiled to get like the best craft beer, and uh, lucky them. Yeah, right. Yeah. <laughs> no, lucky me. I mean, I'm, I'm, I th I've said it before, yeah. I'm definitely the luckiest brewer in, in the industry. I mean, all, all of us are for our 10 locations. We, uh, we're definitely super fortunate to, to be where we're at in the industry. It's, a, mm -hmm. it's, it's competitive. I mean, we, we do, I think we do, not to go ahead. To my own hat. Go ahead. <laughs> I think we do a really good job. Yeah. Uh, that's what we try, especially with the, the core four offering. I mean, it's always uh, it's it, ever evolving industry too. Mm -hmm. So, you know, rising to meet the uh, consumer demands is always something we try to do. And I think we do it pretty well. <laughs> well, last question, I'll push in the hot seat. Which beer pairs well with Barbie? Oh, gosh. Uh, Luna Rosa. Yeah, you had an answer. I, I said Luna Rosa. <laughs> uh, we actually did a Barbie beer. Mm. Um, mm. Yeah, we knocked that out with, um, we turned it pink with dragon fruit. So, okay. Pattaya powder. Um, so we did, uh, gosh, what did we, oh, we did a shandy. Mm. Uh, okay. So we blended our um, original Luna Rosa. This is beer actually evolved from a... Uh, a, uh, a wit beer. Mm -hmm. So it had not, and a nice ester profile to it from the yeast that we fermented out with. Um, we actually did, uh, we made our own soda. Mm -hmm. Turned that soda pink with uh, dragon fruit powder. Okay. And made it pink for Barbie. Nice. This is awesome. Just for Barbie. Just for Barbie. Right. Yeah. No one else. <laughs> no one else. <laughs> um, Matt, the beer is delicious, guys. Come out to Mansfield and, and check out this beer yourself. And uh, say hi to Matt. I'm sure he'll be, he'll be in that back room admiring, polishing his equipment. Actually, yes. <laughs> his immaculate equipment. But uh, nice one getting to know you. Definitely. And uh, great beer. Thanks for the opportunity, man. Yeah, cheers, man. Cheers. <laughs>